because uh, in the most unbelievably erudite and uh, intelligent way, the Coxless Four spoke with such joy about the four years of hard work that has got them gold medals around their neck. And uh, for these boys, it's going to be a silver medal. And a silver medal is a monumental achievement, nonetheless, for two people who've given so much over the last four years. M Mark, you know, we have to talk because we have to talk, and there's probably nothing nothing in the world you want to do less than talk about that race but what are your thoughts now we gave everything we tried everything we wanted to win so badly we're just, just sorry to everybody we've let down you let nobody down after the year that you guys have had you have let nobody down at all Zach if you don't want to talk about it now we'll leave it but can you just tell us what happened at the start with the seat? Just, just whoever had a problem with the seat just came apart and it was fixed, didn't have any bearing on the race. We had, a, we had the very best race we could and the crowd here has been absolutely amazing. We've just, we've really, really, really enjoyed being part of this amazing team and just, just wish it'd been just a little bit quicker for everybody else. <laughs> Listen, I'm going to let you go, but thank you so much for all the help you've given us over the last few years and, you know, you're silver medalist, guys, you know. Sorry, yeah. once again. OK, cheers. Listen, take care. Steve's, Steve will take them down towards the medal ceremony where they'll receive their silver medals. <sighs> emotions, emotions, goodness me. Just, uh, especially when you know these people and you know them pretty well. It's quite, <laughs> it's quite hard being here as well. Right, let's so uh, one more race to go. And it's the women's single skulls. And uh, talk about longevity, Steve's, uh, you know, the living example of that. But here we have Ekaterina Karsten in uh, lane one. Five medals at five consecutive Olympic Games. Can she make it six? What an extraordinary record that would be. Gary, Dan.